Hey everyone, it's your favorite AI guru back again with some breaking news that's sending shockwaves through the tech world. Amazon just dropped a bombshell in their latest earnings report, and trust me, you do not want to miss this. Make sure you hit that like button and subscribe so you don't miss any future updates. Okay, let's cut to the chase. Amazon's cloud division, AWS, is sitting on a backlog of services worth a jaw-dropping $156.6 billion. To put that into perspective, that's bigger than their entire cloud revenue for the year. Let that sink in for a second. Now, you might be wondering what does backlog even mean in this context? Simply put, it's the pile of customer orders for cloud services that Amazon has yet to fulfill. Basically, everyone and their grandma is banging on Amazon's door for more cloud power, especially for all things AI. See, the cloud computing landscape is rapidly evolving, and a huge chunk of that evolution is driven by the insatiable demand for artificial intelligence. We're talking everything from chatbot development to self-driving cars. All that juicy AI goodness requires a ton of computing power, which is where AWS comes in. They're the biggest players in the game right now. And Amazon CEO Andy Jassy knows it. In the recent earnings call, he practically radiated confidence about AWS future, even though it fell slightly short of Wall Street's hyped-up expectations. He emphasized that 90% of IT spending is still on old-school, on-premise systems. Jassy's betting big that this will flip to the cloud, and with good reason. But here's the kicker. Jassy's not just talking about regular cloud migration. He's hyped about generative AI. This tech is already pulling in billions for Amazon, and Jassy predicts it'll grow even faster than their core cloud services. That's a bold statement, considering AWS raked in over $26 billion last quarter. Now, you might be thinking, hold on, isn't Microsoft Azure another big dog in the cloud game? They are. But even with a market share of 23%, they're still lagging behind Amazon, which holds a commanding 32% of the market. And while Microsoft is pumping resources into AI, they haven't quite caught that same generative AI wave that Amazon is riding. But the biggest potential loser in this whole scenario? My bet's on NVIDIA. See, they make the super powerful chips that everyone needs for AI, from Amazon to Google. But if Amazon starts relying more on its own in house AI chips, like the new Tranium and Inferentia processors, that could put a dent in NVIDIA's bottom line. And investors are already jittery about it. The bottom line is this. The battle for AI dominance is heating up like never before. Amazon firing on all cylinders with AWS, Microsoft scrambling to keep up, Google's trying to leverage its own AI prowess, and then there's NVIDIA, potentially facing a future where their cash cow gets leaner. It's a tech showdown for the ages. So what do you guys think? Is Amazon making the right moves by going all in on AI in their own chips? Or are they biting off more than they can chew? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. I'm really trying to build a space where we can all geek out about AI together. Also, hit that thumbs up button if you enjoyed this breakdown. I'm constantly working on creating the best content for you. So let me know what you liked and what you'd like to see more of. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.